Ah, well, hello everybody. Then now we have the most fun against Furball Pests, game number eight. I would have been matched against these even if I'd had the beast. But now, of course, um, I can choose between the beast and a wizard, which is quite good, isn't it? With 180 TV difference. If I had the beast, we'd have 40 TV difference. So I just get to choose the beast or the wizard. Um, the coach is meh. He's got a jugs. He's got a strip wrestle. Dauntless, is that? Well, Niggled, probably. A strength 3 one with bludge step. And he's got a claw mighty blow. Injured to fucking death. He's 939. And I think, well, let's have a look. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I think I'm going to go with a wizard. Because then if he steals the ball off me, I can bolt him, can't I? Um. There you go. I think maybe. I mean, the beast isn't isn't bad. Obviously, an extra play of more fouls. But um, I think the wizard is just better than a beast. So, so for that reason, um, if because if he's like sure, the beast can do work. The beast can do work against Gaven. It can ten strength two guys, which is good, and it can it can make three dice mighty blow blocks. But I don't think it is, Muldrip Star. I really don't think it is. I really, really, really don't think it is. Because the thing is, you're going to need him to activate. And he'll roll a 1. And you've got to keep somebody next to him. Otherwise, he'll roll a 1, 2, or a 3. So, I just don't think it is. I don't think... I don't think all the supposedly good matchups for beasts are good matchups for beasts. <laughs> Thank you, VIP. I see you. <laughs> um, <laughs> that, that's why I don't think it is, because in the supposedly best matchup, he's, he's slower than a. He's, well, okay, he's not, he's not actually slower than, than my reserve. But he's slower than an R, which isn't a reserve. Thanks, Cyanide. Um. He's slower than a fucking guy, and he got more slow. You've got another one. You've got a babysit. It's just exactly very P. Don't Nicholas. Yeah, you know, like uh, I guess this gives him more chance of one turner. But I just want to hopefully make him concede. If he's nine three nine with Skaven, one would imagine he's not the best coach in the world. As harsh as that sounds, yeah, the beast for the tentacles next to the loose ball. Yeah, that's good. That's good. But then you've got to keep somebody next to him. That's the thing. You've got to, like, I don't know, against Skaven. No, because... and I Well, I, I I have done starts without the Beast. Yeah, Master Foul. I got to the final of a Royal Rookie Rumble on Fumble. Like, four wins in a row or something. They get the final. Um, but the thing is, you just don't gain that much by starting without him. And I think he's, you know, three dice mighty blow blitzers are good at rookie level. Especially for fucking Nurgle, where they've got fuck all else. Um, so yeah, oh, I can blitz him with, with Claw Mighty Blow. Oh, baby. Get banged on. One, two, three, four. Got even three dice in. Well, no, I can't actually, because... Then I'll be giving too much up against... Against fucking Gutters, won't I? Um, right, you can block him first. There's a the pressure he gets to block. I gotta think about the the fucking blitz a bit, haven't I? Tbh. Because probably his only chance is going to be getting a blitz. Well, I say that. <laughs> He's got other chances. He's got Skaven, hasn't he? He can always roll some dice. Fucking Skaven, I hate them. Oh. 
the wizard can roll ones just like the beast, yeah. Like it like it did last game. But still, it gives me more of an out to hit a blodge blodge guy than, than anything else. And my shitty little oh god, here we go. Here we go. First first block double skulls. That I mean that's that's handy, isn't it, you know? Against a team that you can't afford to make mistakes against. Um just open it with a fucking failure. My fault, I guess, for not doing safe moves first, you know, like a fucking mighty blow. Fucking block. With block. That was just a misplay, that, wasn't it? That was a fucking misplay, eh? Making a fucking block with block. Jesus fucking Christ. Right. Don't get a knockdown, fucking line rats. Going well. Going well as always, this this game, isn't it, eh? Right. <laughs> um I don't know who the fuck Amy Joe Johnson is. So right, I guess I go for the blitz first just because it's in a tackle zone, there's some players around it. I just wanna hit his guy with claw. This is unsafe, isn't it, after using the reroll. But the payoff is there if I cast him. There you go. Bosh. Bosh. A Lupak like manoeuvre. I blissed him with a claw mighty blow just to use the claw, but obviously he was armor 7 anyway. So that was a bit dumb. I did a bit of a dumb there. Nice. Manage the pickup. Alright. Um, come back here then. In a cage. Just need to protect the claw mighty blow guy. Well, no, the block mighty blow guy rather than the claw mighty blow. Right, not a bad turn in the end. Then A cast his claw mighty blow. But that fucking double skulls. Ah! Right, let me have a look. Um, sludge function are not pro open ladder worth joining where people get there. Yeah, no, not really. No, I just, just playing, just playing, um, I'm just playing champ ladder I would because you know um you know you don't have to be the best to play in champ ladder do you oh it's the pink power ranger um yeah Yeah, well look, the first roll I made was a double score. That got me pissed off. And I failed to knock this guy over with four dice. But, yeah, I'm, I'm obviously not complaining now. Well, he's not the only threat. He's the only threat to my players, isn't he? He's the only... Well, saying that, he's got a mighty blow guy with Frenzy. He's got a dirty player. He's got two gutters um, with skills. So it's, it's hard, it was hardly the only threat. Oh, he's got Even the wrestle sidestep one can do stuff. He was hardly the only threat, to be honest. But yeah, it was nice. It was nice to get that. I mean, I hated having to do it without a reroll. I hated having to do the pickup without a reroll. I hated those two things that I had to do. But um, and good, he's going for the worst player. I love it when you when your opponent um, hits the hits the worst player. It's all about making your well, not making, trying to get your worst players hit rather than your best players, isn't it? Yeah, cunt, 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 foot, cunt would be pretty good sound effect, yeah. Ah. Might be able to hit his roger here. That would be nice, wouldn't it? It looks like he's just giving him, giving him up. That's not doing what I want it to do, is it, there? Oh, it's, it's okay, I guess. Mm. Yeah, I think the both down's okay. Right. 
and then get him in there. Over the halfway line. Unbelievable, Jeff. I guess I'm leaving it a bit easy for him to dodge in by not having a proper a proper YouTube cage. I should have actually done a tighter cage, I guess. No reason not to. Claw Mighty Bowman's looking better than a beast right now, isn't he? 150 TV. He's 10k more, but look how much better he is than a fucking beast. Shithead beast of Nurgle. Go fuck yourself, beast of Nurgle. I'd rather have that guy any day. Yeah, I'll keep it tight in future. There was no reason to keep it, not make it tight that time. Yeah, plus move, Fago. They're going okay, Sam Davies. 5 2 1 at the moment. Yeah, movement Fago is alright, isn't it? Like... One of the best things. Did I not blitz that turn? Probably didn't, yeah. <laughs> it did, I didn't really... I didn't really care, though, did I? Like, nah, I guess I could have blitzed him, but... Mm, maybe he should have blitzed him rather than just coming in to assist. Maybe if I moved three in, I should have blitzed that, yeah. Dodging with line rats, not re-rolling. Glorious. I want mighty blow blitz this cunt, don't I? Which means... A 2D on him with block is perfect. Three dice here. Got him. Oh, shitty strength three. Cunt. Hmm. One, two, three. Uh, no, I can't really. I might just have to dirty play the little bastard then, eh? One, two, three. And come there through... Come through the thing... Right, so move these guys up. In a mega bunker. Seeing as he likes to dodge away, I'm I'm gonna mark this guy on the ground. And just go for the two dice blitz the name. Would love to have three dice him. Oh, got him. Mighty blow. Oh, got him! <laughs> KO. Unbelievable, Jeff. Now I think he probably needs protection, doesn't he? And so does he. Going pretty well. Yeah, well, that was just mighty blow because I blo I, already, I did the three dice block of the mighty blow. It was just three. It was just, it was just mighty blow, wasn't it? It wasn't. It was. It was just for the claw. It was just. Sorry, it was just for the mighty blow. I'd already used my mighty blow block with a three dice. This is how games versus games should go. Yeah, it should. Yeah. Yeah, it did once. Yeah, Almadon, it did. It did.
At least he appoed this though. So yeah, there's one guy. He only had two guys I could use claw on anyway, because this one's already armor seven, so this is the only potential use of claw. I'd have totally fouled that bastard if I'd had my dirty player. Well I mean if he if I hadn't knocked him out. But now he's he's used his apple. If I can knock down a gutter on three dice, I'll foul him. Fireball concede. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm well. I, I heard it was a bug. I never, I never saw it in action. But yeah. Wow, he's failed every line. He's failed every line rat dodge he's made, which is good, isn't it? But then, did he need to make every line rat dodge? Maybe not. Right, so I want to blitz him on three dice, don't I? But I can't. So I'll just blitz him on two dice and base everybody. I'll blitz him on two dice and base everybody. Use the claw. base everyone. That plan failed. But still some people some people are based. Mm. Easier to two dice him unfortunately but never mind. Maybe I should have just blitzed with a claw mighty blow. I thought about just blitzing a line rat with the claw with the block mighty blow, which obviously would have saved me a reroll. But there's only three turns left, quite far forward. Don't think it matters too much. Hello, VIP Aguirre Weeks there in the chat. The man of the hour, <laughs> the man with the power. Too sweet to be so. <laughs> No, it isn't a book selling fan. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Someone should transcribe exactly exactly what it is, because I can't remember what the fuck it was. He still gets to fucking elf screen here, doesn't he? The dirty dingo. But then, I mean, I can just move around. Oh. Roll the one. Fucking elf screen. This shit. Maybe I shouldn't have gone over so so hard at the side here. See, maybe I should have blitzed that guy and had a cage here. That might have been better. And he wasn't even there to stop the dodge out there. Now it's too late to switch back. Well, it's not actually too late to switch back. So, okay, I'll switch back because I think that's a better idea. Get more central. Because if I force down the side here... One, two, three, four, five, six. Make a cage over here. Can't actually get the corner of the cage though. I'd much rather have the ball in the middle. Hmm. I do want to blitz him though, don't I? 
Right, fuck it, I'll just go. I'll just mens him. I'll just mens him and hopes it work. Hope it'll work. I'll go the, I'll go the. Sam Davies pro strat of um, of pretending that basing men on offense is good. Foul him at the end. Shame it's not three dice, isn't it? But what can you do? We've got the pow. Banged on. And he's niggled as well with Mighty Blow. Ho ho ho! Get banged on. That was certainly a better result than blitzing a line rat, wasn't it? And then just go for this. Like, it's obviously not the best use of dirty player against a team with gutter runners and claw Mighty Blowers. But I thought it was better to cage there than than not. Could put him in here. Still got the screen without the send off. Huge. It's huge. Oh man, look at that. <laughs> Bees him to leave him with a one die, just nails it. Nails it, no problem. <laughs> oh look, amazingly the Sam Davies strat of just basing people on offense, not so effective. Leads to a death, leads to a stun and a death. I don't like it. I don't like it. I really don't like fucking basing people. Holy shit. Holy shit, I don't like fucking basing people. Oh man, look at this, minus 2D. He ain't got strip though, has he? You can get surfed here, can't you? You know he's got side stuff. Phew. Yeah, leave them one dice blocks that will block, and then they just pow and stun you, and then 2D and Kaz you. Yeah, exactly, Flash. You know, it's fucking shit, isn't it? Yeah, killing the stripper is pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty huge. Pretty huge. That would have been that would have been stripped and um, up shit creek without a paddle. One dice is my mighty blow guy. Of course, pals him. Of course. How could he not? AV breaks. That's why I don't like to base people, you know. Don't know if I've mentioned it or not, but um, I don't like to base people. Made three dice, got two... Made three blocks, got two stuns and a Kaz. I, I, don't, I don't like basing people on offense. Not a, not a fan of basing people on offense. Right, let's go for the three D first. Claw. He can free up the dirty player on a fucking power, can't he? What about this guy? I think I like the boat down there. Don't really know why. Um, I can go in a cage here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's a bit of a risk, though, isn't it? Not much else I can do.
Still making a meal of scoring is crazy. Safe moves first. And get a power for the foul. Alright, good. This is this is a great video to show why not to base people on offense, isn't it? Eh? A death and two stuns for just random basins. The sad thing is, if he powers me here, I just probably don't score, do I? Not good. Azoron, not good. <laughs> not good. Not fucking good. I can't have fucked this up, haven't I? Like, I couldn't have done much else, but for fuck's sake, I've got to get a power on him. I guess he can score potentially, so it has to be him. Uh, in fact, it's better to do it this way, isn't it? What can he do? He can do two GFIs and a handoff to him. That's better than doing the handoff to him and then he makes the two GFIs, isn't it? Yeah, because then he gets the star player points. What a fucking joke, eh? Having to roll dice, a lot of dice at the end to score after dominating so hard. Feels like Lou Pac, man. Feels Lupac, man. Three, two, two, three. Unbelievable. <laughs> Smashing the fuck out of him. He's got no players on the pitch. Still having to roll three, two, two, three to score. Three, two, two, three. Yeah, that was really bad. I mean, to be fair, he did red dice both down me, but then that was never that going to be that hard, was it? Ten players on the pitch. How many does he have? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Maybe he's maybe got nine, and I maybe got less. I really need that movement guy back. Do I set up to try to stop the one turn? It's hard with the frenzy and the juggernaut. I think the best the best I can do is just backline it. Oh, I guess no warriors on the line. For the disturbing presence, isn't it? Movement four guy.
I can do a lot with fucking frenzy, can't I? <sighs> then he's really going to try to get it going around here. But yeah, he could do it easily. Fuck. That, if you put them close, then they can use frenzy on you. Ah, oh, fuck it, that'll have to do. Hello, Gwyrix, yes it is. Nurgle Beast number one mug. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, what's this? <laughs> fucking cunting cunt of a fucking shithead. Fucking cunt. Cunt. Fucking <laughs> cunt. Cunt. <laughs> Cunt fucking beast. You could be my wingman anytime. That's why I don't like the beast. Bullshit. Oh yeah. Be Beasts are good against elves. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the holes knocks on Twitch. Oh man. What's this one? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good as well. Oh god. That's a pretty good sound file, thank you. Thank you, Fash. <laughs> yeah. Oh, brilliant. Down players against rats. It's the best, isn't it? Best feeling being down players against rats. Actually, nine aside at the moment. One, two. Oh, he caught the fucking thing as well. Really. The fuck is this? The fuck is this? Why can't I just have any luck? And yeah, I know. I know I've fucking Kaz made three Kaz. But really. Three disturbing presents. Come on, fail it. Good. Good. So it was, it was the right play, as it turned out, putting them on. Fucking good old rock. Fucking me as always. Always a Kaz when it hits my guy. Right, please come back. Yes, right, good. Ten players is doable. Night for him. <sighs> Fucking rock, man. Holy shit. I can't even make a wide setup with these players. I gotta put warriors on the line, haven't I? Just to just to do something. Well that's what I think anyway. Feel free to call me wrong if you read the mad. Peace on either side. At least he's got the wizard. Five, six, seven, eight. Wait, has he not got nine? Five, six, seven, eight. I thought he had nine. Did, did he only have eleven players? Or can I just not count? Five, nine. Oh, right, he's got nine. Counted eight over and over again, but yeah, he's got nine. I thought he had nine. Hello, hello, Crumsy, by the way. 
admin fag or crumbsly as you <laughs> um, yeah the Christmas man oh man fucking death he could have been the one that died couldn't he with his fucking movement fall I think he was a badly hurt and a niggle though anyway so I think he's dead so I think it's two deaths Oh! Oh yeah, he gets stunned, see? He gets hit with a rock, gets stunned. My guy gets hit with a rock, dies. That's the that's the rules of Blood Bowl there. In a nutshell. But no, look, of course, I'm just being silly because of um, the fucking OFL mainly, which completely fucked me. I got fucked on with, with um, rocks there. Whereas, of course, I had that game, that amazing game against Grashnak Blackhoof where he just got killed by a rock turn one into concession. Had somebody else, Tomb Guardian got killed turn one. I'm not really pretending that I'm more unlucky than anyone else, but it was really crazy, the OFL league. Yes, roll the one. That is the good thing about no Warriors on the line, isn't it, that they can, that they can do that. Christmas man. Might go for the claw, mighty blow hit on him just because. Ah, I don't know, I guess the block mighty blow is just as good. Double ugly from that bastard. He gets a return block. Glorious. Oh, no, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Yeah, the OFL. The OFL has poisoned me against rocks forever, to be honest. I really want to blitz him. But on the other hand, being able to two dice him with mighty blows is pretty good, isn't it? Although it doesn't stand these guys up. Like it doesn't get them into the action. Maybe they both just stand up. Blitz him. Mighty blow. Block mighty blow. Assist there. Yeah, okay, just stand these guys up. Get him in. The good old basing players. See how that fucking works out for me. That was great, that wasn't it? Nice, KO. Right, now he can block. He can stay behind for the frenzy kind of trap. Mm, he can stay behind for the frenzy kind of trap. He can come back as a safety. He might as well go up there. Make it really hard for him to get two dice over here. Right. <sighs> Fireball can see, but... <laughs> um... Yep, T Voodoo Mike. Oh god, he's an idiot, isn't he? Even though he said that it does, that's the funniest thing. They've said that it does. Like fucking Dawn and Voodoo Mike. Oh man. Oh Weeksy, why'd why'd you have to mention them? Alright, I'm not gonna think about them too. Hey! Starting his turn with a two plus roll, rightly punished for a re-roll. That seems fair. I mean, well, no, I guess it's not fair, is it? There's not much else you could do. Three, four were based, five were based. You only had three players that I guess there wasn't much else you could do. He's still safe, kind of. So, yeah, I guess that was fair enough as a first action, actually. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Weeksy. Yeah, don't don't mention. Please, no more mentioning of Voodoo Mike or Dode. I just, I can't do it anymore. 
<laughs> I just can't. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. Shit that I can't three dice him. I can't bolt him though. So that's good, isn't it? Oh, that's him down. Banged on. Could almost bolt this little cunt, couldn't I? Nah, I don't I wanna save the bolt. Good. One, two, three, four, though. Be a GFI to hit the ball. Or well, one, two, three, four, five, no. GFI from him, too. Can't get the assist in. Can get the assist in here, though. No, shit, he hasn't got block. Oh, what a cunt. Double GFI to hit him. And then foul him. Oh fuck, I wish I hadn't moved him now. Well, in fact, I just wish I'd bolted him. It's gotta be double GFI, hasn't it? To, to three dice with block. Recovery comes from this rotter. Nah, I didn't need the block anyway. As I, as I pick both down. But you know, I mean, I didn't need it, did I? I didn't need... Need that to, um... Now I don't know whether... Uh, it's a four plus. It's too easy for him though, isn't it? Fuck's sake. I think I've got to base him. Mm. Well, he can just base me, can't he? So. I guess I'll do these one at a time. Alright, now I'll go for the GFI and pick up. Because it does make it harder for him, doesn't it? Unless I'm unlucky with a scatter. If on a failure. Right, that was good. Now I'm not going to make a one day, so. Alright, good. <sighs> wow, really, mishaps? Did he have journeyman? Did he have journeyman? In that game. Should <laughs> get a swear jar. <laughs> yeah, that's what my, that's what my uh, tip jar should be, shouldn't it? It should be a swear jar. What's he got? Just wrestle or nothing? Wrestle. Skull. Ah, oh, cunt. Mm. I guess now the bolt on him's better. On one of them, is it? I don't even know. No, because I can blitz this one and get the scatter, can't I? Or, no, I can't change because he's got sidestep. Got more players around the ball this time, though. World Truck Racing, I am excited for it, actually, Weeksy. I am actually excited for it. Holy, oh yeah, of course he makes the one dicer. Gets the pow. And the armor break.
I mean, it's fair enough, because, like, you know, what else are they going to do? But holy shit, it's just annoying, isn't it? It's just annoying. Every one dice block being a power unit on armor break. Fucking hell, man. Just give over. gets boring, doesn't it? It gets boring every single block just being a power and an armor break. Right. I've already given up. I've already lost the chance to, to fucking bolt. Do I go for the scatter? Three, five directions are good. I really want to power him though. I guess he has to come there. Hmm. Oh shit, that was the dirty player. Fuck. Well, he's the rookie anyway. I don't really want to foul the rookie, do I? Bolt's looking worse and worse. Never too late for a fireball. Is he in scoring range now? Yeah, so a bolt next turn. And he can score. Oh, that wasn't the dirty player. Oh, I used the dirty player last. Oh, I'm just fucking seeing things. Holy shit. Misplay from him there, in my opinion. It doesn't matter, of course. Ah, <laughs> foul appearance. Bang down. <sighs> the mad lives on as a meme, yeah. Hello, Ronan, man. Four straight 1D pals. It's annoying, isn't it, Stradi? I'm like, you know, to be fair, like, he's, it's not, I'm not mad at him playing bad. Because what else is he going to do? He's getting banged on a little bit. Could go for the bolt now, couldn't I? The bolt, the blodge stepper, the rod stepper. Three dice him. Three dice him. There. Pick up score. Yeah. You want to bolt that one, though? All right. Good. Good, um, good bolt. All right. Yeah, to be fair, I've bashed the fuck out of him. So, like, you know, I can't really complain about the rock and all of this shit. I haven't made a blitz yet. I have, I could blitz there. And then assist one, two, three, four. Yeah. That gives me another assist to the foul as well. Which is nice. He can go there to isolate the uh, rogue runner push. Or a double skull. Either either one. That's fine. Mm. 
What's better? If he picks it up here, he just gets a 2 plus dodge out. He gets a 3 plus, 2 plus, pick it up, 2 plus dodge out. If I run around there, then he's got to dodge this way. So yeah, I'll dodge out this way and then dodge there. But he might as well just dodge there on a 4 plus. If I get sent off. Well, if I get sent off, it doesn't matter where I am, does it? If I don't get sent off and I don't break AV. If I'm here, he's got to go. It's just harder, isn't it? I think it's better to go here. Oh, God, not like that. God, he can reach to base from where he is. I don't like GFI, do I? Because I can always blitz him next turn. And then the dodge will have a reroll. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Not gonna make any GFIs. You can use the wizard at the start or the end of your turn, Blood Mantis, so unless it's the first thing you do. It, it's only if it's not the first thing you do that it ends your turn immediately. <sighs> yeah, that Kaz box. The Kaz box is looking pretty good, to be fair. And, like, you know, I shouldn't be mad about taking two cars from Rotters. But one was part of me being a, doing a dumb. Hey. One was part of me doing dumb things. Oh, man. That's really tempting me to just not score, isn't it? Really tempting me to not score. Just foul him with a dirty player. Then next turn foul him. Like I guess if I'm two nil up, I've won, haven't I? I guess if I'm two nil up, I've have won. So I should. I should just score. But um. Yeah, I guess I should just go. I'm going to block him, though. So I'm not really just going to score. So now the question is... Do a handoff to a warrior. <sighs> Only if I kill both of his gutters. Which I'm not going to do. One in eighty one. I'll risk it because two and up have one. Oh, yeah, had to follow to get the better animation. Right, just score, make it safe. Just make it safe. Yeah, that's the thing, Callum Essie. The, the, with the wizard, is you can use it at the start of your turn or the end of your turn. So if you haven't, if you haven't done anything yet, if oh god, sorry about the bang. Right. Um. So, yeah, if you use it as your first thing, if you haven't moved any players or stood anybody up or anything, then it counts as at the start of your turn. If you've if you've moved what like stood up one guy or whatever, 
and you use a wizard, it, it counts as using it at the end of your turn, so it ends your turn. So yeah, that's what it is. Oh yeah, I skipped the animation, didn't I? Shit. Yeah, because because this has happened and it makes me sad. Poor Rotter's dying. Makes me sad. When I've got a fucking dirty player. Dirty player is shit if you've only got 11 players, isn't it? Oh my god, this banging. I'm sorry, Bad Roger. I have them on because they're cool, and then I just skip them every chance I get. It's funny, isn't it? <laughs> Rainbow Clown Wig. Oh, man. <laughs> That'd be the funniest thing ever. I'll <laughs> be a sub god. Um, oh god yeah that's true Tony plays poorly do you know what there is there is racing um, in GTA there is truck racing um, you can google June racing um, on GTA 5 here we are this will this will be one. He's got six views on this video that w that came up on a Google search, so you should definitely show this guy some views. There you go, look, they're racing with trucks. This is as much of a truck race as you can get in GTA. Um so I might make I might make some truck races in GTA. Now well, we failed the thing. It serves him right for being a shit gun and being all rear old. the ball there. How can, how can I get it? I can't get it, can I? He can base it. It's all about basing balls, isn't it? No, oh, death! Yes! Yes, I really wanted that to get a free player. That's that's great. That's great. I'm happy. I'm happy about that. I just move the dirty player there, dickhead. Yeah, I'm pretty happy we're getting a rotter there. Can I reach here? No. He can reach there. No, oh, but then he just stands up to cancel the assist, so he's got to come back as well. Oh, it's easy. I don't know, man. And then he does, he does the GFIs to base the ball. Come on. 11 star player point warrior. Holy shit. He's a badass. The beast was sacked, Ducky. Because he lost me the game against the Wood Elves, so I sacked him. Rotters. Regen farting. Yeah, it is pretty great, but my stuff. <laughs> no Bretonia. Oh man. Brett's a dirty dingoes. Oh yeah! Yeah. Oh he failed. He rolled a double one. Into getting fouled next turn. It's alright, innit? This is going pretty well now. I, I'm, I'm sure somebody's going to die next turn because this is going way too well. He wants to blitz into picking up the ball and scoring, doesn't he? Right. So do I have a block guy here? No. 
Dirty player is definitely going to foul him at some point. If I block him first, then I can move the movement seven there and chain him forward one. That's what I want to do. Right, so hopefully get the knockdown here. That was a one dicer. Because that guy's on the ground. God. Not my greatest hour there. <laughs> right. So G5 for the assist. Is he... No, he's rookie. I still want to make it. No, I do I want to make it three dice? No, I need the reroll, don't I? fucking hero. Right, then he just fouls him just because. He can't get the ball. He can't get the foul in. Foul the guy who's already stunned just because he got a runner. He was good. Teach him a good lesson about having an armor six got a runner. No. Fail. Bring the bread cup back. I remember that. He's a good warrior, isn't he? On 11. I'd love him to get to 14. Chin pushing the down guy was fine. It was just making it a one dice instead of a two dice because of it was what was bad, wasn't it? <laughs> right. Ugly bastard. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do. Well, can I make it a three? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, nearly could nearly make it a three dice. So. Mm, he's got claw. How greedy am I? Do the block one first. Oh, I'm so good at blood ball. <laughs> right. GFI though. Not happy about the GFI. Got it. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is rolling like loop back here. It is. <laughs> Giving gobbies to you on truck drivers for cash. <laughs> oh, man. That was a pretty good game, wasn't it, in the end? I was a bit sad to have that guy die, but the movement 4 one dying is okay because he was movement 4 already. Six for winnings. Alright. Right, he wants to join for free, so I buy him. Yes. <laughs> Succeeded. Hardest thing about using Nurgle is is getting free players. Seven nineteen AV breaks into seven cars and four KO. That's pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> That's pretty good. Yep, it's finally succeeded GFI with a reroll in hand. So now if he's injured. But he's not missed next game. He was only—he must have been double badly hurt. I thought he'd been—I thought he'd been killed. All right, well, I got twelve players, and that's all right, isn't it? I just—I just thought that I'd—I um, just thought that he'd been niggled. Yeah, only lost one. Rot didn't lose any rotters then in the end. Didn't lose any rotters because I just thought he'd been niggled, but he hadn't. I really want to sack this fucking agility one warrior, but. I can't, can I? Have to keep him. Have to keep only two Pestigors for a while, I think. I think because he wants to score a few more times to be a viable player. Um, one, two, three, four, five. I'd really like to give him Dirty Player and, um, and get a 13th player. But I guess 
it's best not to. Yeah, I've got I've got to keep him because he's on nine star fucking player points. Yeah, I've got to keep him. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get rid of him. But um, no, if he if he'd still been on two, I would have sacked him. But um, yeah, if he was on two, I would have sacked him and replaced him. But when he's on nine, it's just too good having a block. Um, yeah, exactly. A block agility one warrior is better than agility two one without. Yeah, exactly. Linoda's 13 nails it, but had he been on two star player points still, I would have sacked him. But yeah, obviously once he's got block, I ain't going to sack him. Um, right. Even though I would have sacked an agility 2 block warrior instantly, instantly replaced an agility 2 chaos warrior. Once you're already fucking agility 2, it's not that bad. Um, probably one MVP and two chaos, yeah. Yeah, because he was on two before. Um, so I think just more block, really. I'd love to. I'd love to do eight players and go to thirteen players, though. Because that's going to be good if I'm down TV, isn't it? Having the two dirty players and thirteen men. I do like to foul. I don't. Know, I'll think about it before the next video. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.